being such a rare personality type definitely creates its own unique brand of struggles for the INFJ. They deal with many hurdles and difficulties in life, simply because they operate differently than the norm. INFJs can endure many struggles in life because of these differences, and they become even more overwhelming when they don't fully understand why. It does help the INFJ to take time for self-reflection and to learn more about why they feel the way they do. Knowing about themselves and their own personal behaviors really can help the INFJ feel more comfortable in their own skin. The statistic shows that 95% of the viewers are not subscribed, kindly consider subscribing to get notified when we upload a new video, it helps a lot. Without further ado, here are four frequent INFJ struggles which they experience in life. 1. Perfectionism. INFJs are often perfectionists, and this is something which can be overwhelming at times. They struggle with never really feeling like anything they do is good enough. They will look over their own work and accomplishments and almost always see mistakes and ways they could improve. This perfectionist nature makes the INFJ have truly amazing standards, but also can be a struggle for them throughout life. It is hard when they never feel truly satisfied with their abilities or the things they have accomplished. This is something which weighs heavily on the heart of the INFJ and makes them come down rather hard on themselves. Constantly feeling like they could be improving and always analyzing their tasks is something which can be exhausting after a while. The INFJ might second-guess themselves constantly, causing them to hold back from doing things they enjoy or want to go after. This can leave them feeling stagnant and struggling to ever really take chances in their lives. This is something the INFJ constantly struggles with, but they can work hard to overcome this and find ways to become more open. 2. Boundaries INFJs struggle when it comes to boundaries, since they are always striving to help others. This is something which can cause the INFJ to give to people who really don't deserve their kindness. It sometimes leaves the INFJ feeling overwhelmed because they take on too much all at once. They find themselves constantly trying to help others and don't find it easy to set boundaries with how much they are willing to give. This is a struggle the INFJ must learn to overcome in life, and as they grow they can figure out how to set boundaries in their relationships. If the INFJ isn't careful they can really wear themselves out, constantly trying to care for others who don't appreciate this or give back to them. INFJs simply do this because they are caring and giving people, but learning boundaries is truly important for them. They need to find ways to take care of themselves as well and spend time figuring out their own inner wants and desires. Without tending to their own personal needs the INFJ will become drained and overwhelmed. While boundaries really aren't easy for the INFJ, they are truly important and something they need to find the balance with. 3. Finding Purpose INFJs often feel inside that they are meant to serve a greater purpose but aren't quite sure what that is. From a young age they struggle with finding this sense of meaning and purpose in their lives. The INFJ truly wants to be someone who can make a difference in the world around them, but this desire can be a struggle for them throughout their lives. They want to search for and uncover this purpose, but might not be sure exactly how they are meant to do this. This is something which places a lot of pressure on the INFJ, especially when they feel like they aren't really making any progress in the right direction. But ultimately the important thing is for them to find something which helps others, and this will help bring purpose to their lives if they are willing to recognize it. 4. Alienation INFJs require plenty of alone time in order to recharge, and this does sometimes cause them to feel alienated. They distance themselves because they need this space, but they do want to feel connected to their loved ones. The INFJ certainly struggles with feeling alienated throughout their lives, both because of their need for alone time and the fact that they feel so misunderstood. The INFJ often feels like people don't get them, and this makes them feel distanced from those around them. Their unique personality and the fact that they are so rare definitely has its struggles for the INFJ. They want to be able to feel close to people and really want to feel like their loved ones understand who they are inside. This inner desire to feel connected is something which makes it truly upsetting for the INFJ to feel so alienated from the rest of the world. 
They process things differently and have their own set of morals, ones which make it hard for the INFJ to really feel connected to the world around them. INFJs really have their own beliefs, which can be so different from the norm, since they have strong inner morals and their minds process things differently. This is part of what makes the INFJ so compassionate and special, but it can also alienate them in ways which can be rather upsetting for them. Having a desire to feel close to others, but not necessarily knowing how to make people understand what is going on inside, can be a constant struggle. Feel free to share your thoughts. Did you experience these things as an INFJ? Do you have any wisdom to share? Let us know in the comments. See you in Anther video.